reasons why a man leaves his wife or file for divorce. Number one is another woman pushing him to do it, okay? Or number two is something real foul went down. I know, I know, come on. Thank you, right? Thank you. Come on, and I also know N-U-N. That's Ooh, I love you. He's a flirt. That's I love you. Hi it's been less than a week since the bombshell news about rapper Jeezy filing for a divorce from Jeannie Rock that internet and fans have been speculating, trying to figure out what could have possibly led to their separation well it seems like we finally know the answer and guys get ready because it's far away from everything we had suspected everyone and welcome back to celeb live channel so right when we thought that this chapter has been closed forever and we have to live with the fact that one of the most beloved and healthy couples in show business went separate ways Insiders brought us more juicy details about the wild dynamics in Jeannie and Jezzy relationships. We filed for a divorce from Jeannie Ma after finding sex tea with host Mario Lopez. So what I do, I go look it up. So it said explicit pictures or explicit text messages. Jeezy and his soon-to-be ex-wife Jeannie were reportedly not on the same page when it came to certain things in their Marriage apparently the sweet period of dating was so much different than the married life together and as one insider claimed they had different views and each felt like their needs weren't being completely met however such an explanation raised my eyebrows since the couple couldn't stop gushing about each other's merits in their joint and separate interviews then came the rumors that Jeezy was adamant in this union because he had caught Jeannie cheating on him with Access Hollywood host Mario. Lopez, I mean, it may be just a wild theory invented by fans, but it's hard to deny the chemistry between these two and the looks Mario has been casting on Janny when he was interviewing her. Grown, grown. We're in our 40s. And what yeah. I think is that God somehow know. managed our timing so that we spent time after our long-term relationships. Yeah. We both came from 10-year relationships. And we really worked on ourselves to really understand what healthy love is like. Jamie never gave any signs of being unhappy with Jeezy, but fans began talking about her infidelity on Jeezy after noticing and resurfaced clips how comfortable the couple's daughter was around another man well since the video was released one month before the divorce bombshell was dropped. It's now. Highly speculated if Jeezy confronted Jeannie about cheating in his divorce filing. He categorically stated that they've been separated, the marriage is irretrievably broken, and there is no hope for reconciliation. In addition, Jeezy demanded a joint legal custody of their daughter Monica. Now this is just one side part of the story, but as insiders claim it's not the end of it, and Monica is actually the reason why the couple is divorcing. First day at the job, guys. Hey, <laughs> proud uh, Vietnamese girl. We're both yes. first generation. I'm gonna have her hook me up with some uh, Vietnamese. I know a little. Now, one source close to the Atlanta rap superstar and former co host of The Real doesn't have the same principles as Jeannie, as this person said. The couple didn't agree on certain family values and expectations. If you don't know the story behind Jeannie, Heritage, let me spill some tea for four. You as an immigrant who escaped Vietnam to start a new life in Northern California, Maya's mom is still very proud of their culture and she taught Jeannie to respect and love her roots. However, it came with certain complications and as Jeannie once said, it's horrible dating with Mama Maisha is nosy when I was a kid she would be. The first one eavesdropping on my phone calls hello who you call for huh still today every time my phone goes off with die for it and lose nails because she's the one looking to see who i'm dating now it seems like mama may had her say in this relationship as well and apparently she had a huge impact on her daughter which may have been annoying for jeezy to witness because in the end Janie was a grown-up woman Love the black guys. Yeah, yeah, I did, I did. But for me, dark meat on the side, white keeps me mean and lean. You know, that's why I, I married white man. That's what I like. Hold up. 
Apparently, Mama May had her own vision of how to raise her granddaughter Monaco, and she was persistent of teaching this young baby to be a true Vietnamese girl, as Insider now claims Jeezy didn't even have a say about this matter because Mama Mamie was everywhere with her rules and traditions. It was quite offensive for Jeezy that his daughter was getting such a one-sided education. Didn't hit it off well with oh. the beginning. Miss Persnippity over here, okay? Yeah. She was she she pointing at me. Honey. Are you pointing at me? Yes. yes. What's a persnip? She was real high for Diddy. Persnippity like. I was? You don't know me. No, that's I not have true. 14,000 shows on TV. You are lying. I am lying. In the end, Jeezy just felt overwhelmed by the entire situation, and I can totally understand him. He wanted to be fully included in the process of upbringing his daughter, but apparently with Mama my influence he couldn't do it, so the only rational decision the rapper could do is to stop this drama. Once and for all, and get separated from the main source of evil in the family. Even if it came at such a price well it was a little bit of paranoia, one admirable thing about Jeezy he isn't trying to escape. Ye. His responsibility as a father, and in fact with this tough decision, he's choosing what's the best for his child at the moment after getting the scope of what's happening in the family social media users expressed their support for the rapper. As one person commented, I can't feel sorry for Jeezy this. Is what happens when you jump into somebody else's culture and marry within the culture. Without learning about the culture, this was a waste of time and money, and another user added, can't blame Jeezy yet would have moved out as well too much to come home to when I'm away no peace in the kingdom, where else would I get my peace according to the rumors Cheesy is done with this drama. And even his love for Jeannie cannot change this however, as it was revealed Jeannie is still hoping for reconciliation and expects to win this battle by reminding Jeez that her culture and respect for motherly figure is something the rapper has to deal with. You mean dark meat on the side? That means, honey. That's it. You know what that means. Wait, what are you reading it as? I know, but what, how did you say it? <laughs> I'm just saying it like, I, when, like, when I think about men, I like <laughs> dark men. I do. I right, like you'd like your main man to be white and the, your side be okay. yeah. Now, let's see what this epic battle will bring. Because Junie has always been vocal about the huge influence of other family members in her culture, and Jeezy had to wrap his mind around the fact that Vietnamese come in package, as she said, in the protection of her mom, she's there for life, but even. Though it's hard to date with my mom around, I'm so thankful for it, because the person who can't take Mama Mahi is not the person to take me, you know what I'm saying, like in Asian culture, you have to be dip. Own with the family since Mama May will continue to play a role in Jeannie May's life. It casts a doubt on the possible reconciliation of Jeezy and Jenny's relationship. And I don't know how the TV host is planning to chase both these goals, trying to please her mom and keep her husband in her heart. When y'all file for divorce, it's over. Yeah, because usually guys yeah. don't yeah, strike first. Yeah, y'all not emotional like that. Nah, so whatever it was. Oh, what could it have been? Right. There's yeah. two reasons why a man leaves his wife or file for divorce. Number one is another woman pushing him to do it, okay? Or number two is something real foul went down. At the beginning of her marriage to Jeezy, Janie confessed that she wanted him to lead the family narrative because she was tired of playing a strong woman all the time. Molly explained that she also desired to take more of a submissive role after assessing her parents' marriage, which ended in divorce. She said she would be down with Guy's making major decisions when it comes to their mutual life and apparently she completely forgot of how influential her own mom could be. It seems like Jeannie is truly torn between her man and her mom and she cannot decide who of them to betray with her harsh decision. It doesn't help her that she and Mama May were estranged for almost eight years after Jenny ran away from the house and then spent years and thousands of therapy trying. To make up with her mother well, if there's one person who wants to rule the household and make his own terms in this situation more than Mama Mahi, it's cheesy he already made the first step when he filled. Ed for divorce and later he began throwing shade on Maya's family writing cryptic messages on his Instagram, too focused on who in becoming focused on who's not coming with me. Was that a jab at Jeannie, the love of his love and the mother of his child, or was he talking about Mama Me? Well, we can only wonder until we get the final answer one thing for sure, G is torn between these two people she loves the most and doesn't know whose side she wants to choose in this incident. Well, this mess is going to last for a while, so I hope you sucked enough popcorn for more episodes of this divorce drama fans on social media. 
are already waiting for more details to come out, and they believe that when Janie finally addresses the divorce situation, she will have to pick her side and it may be just another surprise for all of us, as one person commented a lot of relationships are destroyed because of other family members inserting themselves in their relationships and another user. Added, if the mother is the problem she had to go, she allowed her mother to disrespect her husband and his culture while it clearly looks like there were too many people in this relationship. And that's why it had sadly ended. And what do you think about this guys who's to blame for Jeannie and Jeezy? Divorce? And could they still be together? Share your thoughts in the comments below. I'm eager to know what you're thinking. And in the meantime, check my other videos about Hollywood drama as well. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned. And I promise to be back very soon.